Hey guys, it's Emisa and Aaron. Well, today we're coming to do a video because Aaron's hair was straight. Can't tell, but the rain got to it, and so her natural curls are trying to convert back. But um, since she has somewhere to go today, we're just gonna hook it up. And she's 12 years old, so she's like in between the stages of not wanting to wear ponytails anymore and wanting it to be a little bit more mature. So hopefully this video will help um, some mommies out who has the, what is it called, Aaron? Preteens? Tweens? The tweens! Pre -teens. No, preteens. Oh, my bad. Preteens. Okay, so we're going to do a side braid that's going to come all the way around. And this side, we're going to flat iron a little bit and put some curls. I think that'll be cute. Now again, um, we're going to use the 44 iron guard that I used in my hair on the previous video. And if you hadn't seen it, go back and look and we will finish it off with the Miracle Shine Spray. I have a water bottle. Remember that edge brush? I got it, because she's with me. I have that. I have our Eco Styler for her edges, and smoothing brush, the tangling brush, and same flat iron I used before. So we're gonna get started. I'm gonna detangle it. So Aaron, how was your day? No school? Um, it was okay. It was okay? Yeah. You wanted to be at school? I mean, I like school because it's fun, but I don't want to take a test. <laughs> so this is parts of her hair that didn't get frizzy underneath, so you can tell that it's still really smooth but the outside oh my gosh <laughs> yeah so tell everybody about yourself Aaron's the youngest yeah I'm the youngest out of the family um I'm 12 I go to Sherwood Middle Magnet I'm in seventh grade um I have a business called Hearts Ease Cupcakes and that really came from my allergy, so I just did it. And uh, I have braces, if y'all can see, I have braces. Um, and that's, that's it. That's it. What's your favorite thing to do? Um, maybe bake or dance, bake one of the dance. two. Cause okay. I have a passion. For both of those. So. Okay. So I'm just taking one little piece out. Um, because it's braided, I'm going to be braiding it. It's okay uh, to put a little bit of her natural texture out, even though I'm flat ironing this side. Well, we'll see. We'll see how it turns out. But I am putting a little bit of gel in it right now in water. So it is going to start curling up in certain areas spray smooth it out and is this like the thing your age want to have like pieces out no? yes yeah. okay and you're gonna tell me if this hairstyle is ugly right mm -hmm. <laughs> well thanks Aaron. So are you excited about being 12? Mm, it's not really it's like much of a change. It's the same. Okay. So what is your ideal age? Like, what can you wait for? Or do you want to go back and be younger? Um, I, I don't really want to be younger. 
I would rather be like 14 and like stay 14. Okay. I just like that age. Why? I don't know, cause it's like, hmm, I'll be in high school and high school is fun and stuff. And my birthday's on the 14th. Okay. I don't know. I just like it. Let me tell you something. If mommy can go back, being an adult is overrated, girl. Hmm. If mommy can go back, I would. 14 was fun for me. Yeah, yeah it just seems like a fun age. Yeah. It's like not old and not too young. So, I'm old. Aaron. <laughs> so, uh, that's a yes. <laughs> it's all right. Keep living, little homie. Okay. Well, you're just not too young. <laughs> I guess. Okay. I hear you. So I'm just going around and uh, braiding it like a crown, like this. Oh, this one. All right. So I did braid it all around. And when you get to maybe about right here, turn a little bit, right here, you can just secure it with a twisty or a bobby pin. Turn back this way. I think I have a twisty or a bobby pin. Let's see. I do not. So I need you to hold this, this piece. And I will be right back. So you talked about me while I was gone? Mm-mm. Oh, okay. <laughs> All right, hold this again. Okay. All right, so I'm securing the ponytail with a, an elastic. I'm leaving the bottom out. And the elastic actually won't show because it's gonna be covered by all of this hair. So I'm gonna spray it again with the Chi 44 Iron Guard. See, I really spray hers down. I didn't really spray mine down, but I protect theirs. And you wanna, you wanna let it dry because if you put the flat iron directly on hair that is wet, and this is wet right now, it's gonna fry. We don't want that at all. So I'm just gonna make sure that I combed it out good. And while that's drying, I am going to spray down this little piece. You're gonna make it curly? Yeah, I'm gonna. Put a little eco styler gel in it. And it's not converting all the way right now because it was long straight, which is a good thing because I don't want it to be too curly because the other side is gonna have some curls in it. I'm gonna lay down her edges. So yeah, it's kind of tough with a 12 year old it's like that in the state in between stages something else because you do want to help your daughters mature in their look but um you don't want to go overboard so sometimes it is kind of hard finding that middle i'm gonna slick down her edges a little bit and I'm not the best with that. Aaron will 
definitely let me know too. She's like, that's not cute. But I do the best that I can. I think you look good, huh? Yeah. And Erin, when her hair is straightened, she has a lot of good control over her hair. And um, she will do it for school when it's straightened, but when it's curly, it's hard. Yeah, as y'all know, like when it's in the curly stage, ooh, it can be a little hard to deal with. You want your curls going back this way or forward? Back. Back, okay. And just like with my hair, I don't, necessarily flat iron her ends. I leave them out. And we'll blend it so it won't look like, like it's just unfinished. We'll fluff it out and blend it. So Aaron and Ilan and I, we're gonna do um, a video together because although we all have the same skin color almost, we have different undertones. And so I have three, three or four new red lipsticks and we're gonna determine, although Aaron doesn't wear red lipstick, but, um, we're gonna determine what lipsticks are best for which undertone. You ready about that, Erin? Mm -hmm. You excited? I'm not really. Anytime you put on red lipstick, that's exciting, huh? Usually I just wear lip gloss. Yeah. But. What's your favorite lip gloss? Like clear or, cause I'll let her wear tinted lip gloss, but not mm -hmm. red, but um, like pinks and nudes. I'm okay with that. So which which one is your favorite? I like clear, but like I like it a little bit pink because mm -hmm. it just like makes in with my lips. So yeah, but you and Ilana have really pretty brush. lips. Um, because y'all have really pink pink lips, and mommy, I don't know, my lips are like a darker color. They're not bad, but they don't look as pretty as you guys when y'all wear clear lip gloss. Like I really have to put on like a tinted lip gloss. And know what else I think is cute? The, um, how they have the clear gloss with the like glitter specks on it. Is oh, that yeah. cool or not cool? I like that. Okay. But I don't like them. The glitter would be like too be, much. Yeah, you know the shimmer glitter. It's like mm -hmm. real fine. Yeah, cause that sort of like brings highlight. Yeah, or something like that. It glows when it hits light or the sun. Okay. Yeah, I guess. I wish I could wear that though, but y'all look so pretty in it. I can live through y'all. So let's talk about makeup. Cause mommy, mommy doesn't wear makeup, but I'm obsessed with lipstick. I love lipstick. Oh, yes, she does. I love lipsticks, but not all colors. I like red and like dark colors like this and uh, nudes. I like peaches too, mm -hmm. but I'm not, Oh, and, and I'm obsessed with um, mascara. Yeah, like tender for mascara. <laughs> but that's about it as far as like putting base and all of that other good stuff on. I don't even know how to apply it, so I don't even, I don't even bother with it. But I do have concealer. I will wear concealer because sometimes your girl looks tired. I don't really wear makeup. Well, I don't wear makeup at all. I just do. You, do you think mommy's too strict on you with with makeup? Mm. Is it that you want to wear it and I just don't 
The I wet just don't trip? like it. Okay. I don't, I don't think it'll look good on me. Well, mommy thinks that you're beautiful even without lip gloss. That's how I feel about you and Ilana. Like, I just love, love, love seeing y'all natural, especially when y'all wake up in the morning. It just melts my little heart. She's so cute. But I get it. Just, you know, when you get a little bit older, just because mommy doesn't wear doesn't mean that you have to fall suit. But I always want y'all to be comfortable with very natural. Your natural look. Yeah. I don't think the most I would ever wear makeup is on like a special occasion. Special occasion. Girl. Like so on a, a special occasion, what you gonna put it all on? Like Can, you gonna go full out or uh -uh. no? Speaking of, let me tell you something. Mm -hmm. When when you don't wear makeup a lot and you put some makeup on, you better get the right person to do it because they'll have you looking like a clown. Let me tell you, I went to the mall one day and so this lady at the Clinique counter, shout out to Clinique, she was like, let me do your makeup. And I'm like, okay, perfect, y'all. It was, I looked like, I looked awful, let's just, be clear. You look like Pennywise the Clown. I look like Pennywise the Clown. That was a good description. But it, it was bad. It was bad. But she put she put on so much. Like it was like four layers or something. I had a contoured nose. Oh, it was too much. Okay. So I curled it, turned to the side a little bit. And I didn't curl all the way to the ends because I try to protect those, like I said. But um, when I fluff it out, you won't even tell that the ends are not done. So I'm gonna close your eyes in, spray it with the Miracle Shine spray, my favorite stuff. Mm -mm -mm. You like this stuff in here? It shines. <laughs> it makes it shine. Okay, lean up a little bit so y'all can see. Oh, God. look at that shine. Look at this. And look, oh, I just love this stuff. Okay, so now we're gonna fluff it out a bit. Okay, turn to the side. So I think this is a cute little look for 12 year olds. You still have your youngness with the braid going around. Got your little baby hairs to young it out. Got your little curls. She said these are cool. And then she got a little grown side. So I'll be doing videos um, when I do Aaron's hair, sometimes anyway, uh, so that you moms can have an opportunity to see different hairstyles. And if you guys know some hairstyles that we can try on Aaron for the tween, no, you said don't say tween, huh? Preteen. The preteen stage. Um, let us know and we'll try it. And Erin will tell you the truth if she doesn't like it. No, you, you, oh. tell <laughs> you gotta tell them the truth. All right, well, that's it, you guys. You like it, Erin? Mm -hmm. I think it's cute too. Girl, you are popping, you are just popping. But, anyways, we're signing out again. This is all things steward and in the darkness, always be always what? Be the Always be the light.